would you? The bit up top looks like a giant salad spoon. That is no spoon. It is a spice station. Look at the size of that thing. Quit your chattering. Arm yourself for the fight to come. are of no use. Full speed ahead and dock before they destroy the ship. Get ready for us. I knew this was a terrible plan. I don't know about you, but I like a straight-up fight. Get him! <laughs> That's a big door. Can get it open. Come on, we've got a job to do. Mouse breaths and barnacles. Have you ever seen the like? Amazing! Such a brilliant design. If only the College of Engineers could see this. Watch your step. It's a long way down. And a long way up, too. So, lass. Which way do we go? The guns we need to knock out are at the end of the three spokes, and in the main battery up top. The ramp there must lead up to the spokes. Let's start with them. That should lead to the first gun platform. Come on! have prepared us quite a welcome to battle! are these? Cain's building angels, is he? Intruders, surrender immediately or you will suffer. Never! Let's get him! like they must use these machines to load the guns mechanically. Time to break out the Delignite. Well done. Now, if I'm right, they'll store the ammunition down below. Let's go stick a spanner in the works. More guards! And here I was worried they'd run out.
She's well built, all right. But a few well placed charges are to tear things up well and good. Let's get to work. Saboteurs located. Commence attack. Mechanical men? They don't give up, do they? The Celestial Ministers were easier to argue with. Defensive assault. Wonder if we'll find more clockworks down there. Let's get this over with. What is this place? Something strange be here, Captain, my Captain. Beware. It looks like a workshop for a madman. Hey, look! It's one of the golden wheels from the Isle of Doom. Is. Aye, it's an ancient carving. There's a lot of them in the ancient lizard ruins back on Skull Island. But the clockworks have got it molded into some kind of machine. Why? Excuse me, what precisely is this? Don't touch that! This is a... well, it's a kind of 
camera, but instead of making a photograph, it can capture a moving image. Something's been recorded recently. The device is also a magic lantern. We can use it to see what they recorded. Magic? Not wizard magic. It involves refracted light, spun through... Oh, never mind. Here, let's get it set up. Yeah, who are you? Answer, or feel the wrath of El Toro. It can't hear you. It's just a picture that moves. That's Bishop, Kane's mad tinkerer. Listen. Supreme Commander Kane, greetings from Marleybone. General Rook is, as you know, engaged elsewhere. Thus it falls to me to send this report. The campaign proceeds according to plan. If events follow current trends, I project Marleybone's surrender within a week. The end game is imminent. Step one. A naval assault on the Isle of Fesh. Last bastion of the Marlebonian defense. Step two. General Rook uses our new treaty with Mushu to launch a massive new attack into Marleybone, not from Valencia, but through Hamamitsu. With the Royal Navy's attention focused on the Isle of Fetch, Rook's attack will take them completely by surprise. Step three. Once the Royal Navy is destroyed, the station's cannons bombard Marleybone into submission in a matter of days. Checkmate. On a more personal note, I long for a swift end to this wasteful conflict so that I may return my full attentions to the grand design. I trust you are making progress with the Celestian computations and regret I can report little progress in the matter of the clockwork birds. I can confirm that your suspicions about their maker are correct, and I have identified the markings on their gears as Aquilin Linear B. But what the inscriptions say or why the toy maker should send so many of his birds into Valencia and Marleybone remains a mystery. Working diligently toward total victory, I remain your loyal servant, Bishop. The Armada prevails. What is this? How did you get in here? Lay down your weapons. You are my prisoners. Not a chance, bird beak. You're our prisoner. Oh dear. Guards, eradicate them. Enough of this place. Let's get out of here. No! The job's not done. We've got two more guns to sort out. The clockworks? Bring them on. Are you afraid? Saboteurs identified. Incapacitate them.
clockworks are getting stronger. Oh, I fear we have kicked a hornet's nest. Confound the clockworks! Full speed ahead! Shall we try again? I don't know why you've come, but your meddling in this station ends now. Wait, I, I know you. You're the pirate who destroyed Deacon. Oh my, Kane must be notified at once. Me. Let's deal with this gun and be done. No clockworks? Can it be they finally run out? Old Bird Beak recognized the captain, and they've turned tail. Now, Captain, my captain, they fear you. But I and I wonder, it is a good thing. Three down, the biggest to go. Let's take that lift up to the main battery. Entry is forbidden. Incapacitate the intruders. Ready for more, I see. Shall we dance? I can only assume, Pirate, that you have come to try and sabotage this station's artillery. If I may speak frankly, what a puny plan. This station is the pinnacle of Armada artistry and engineering. Your attempts to sabotage it are doomed to failure. Beachhead is indestructible. Rook was so looking forward to destroying you in revenge for Deacon. A pity I shall deny him his opportunity by finishing you now.
Another time, pirate. Confound it! Bird Beak's flown the coop! Still, he's left us his toys to play with. Let's take a look at the pinnacle of Armada artistry. Indestructible, he says. We'll see about that.
I'm afraid Bishop may be right. Look, that's chromium steel. All the gelignite we brought wouldn't be enough. I don't think we can destroy... Wait a moment. The hydraulics! They're using volatile fluid, but there's no pressure compensator. What the devil does all that mean? Well, you see... Never mind. It's technical. I think we can destroy the main gun from the inside. We need to take the lift all the way down. This is the world they will build if we do not stop them. I'm right. We can do this. Listen, the clockworks are using hydraulics, hot liquid under high pressure, to turn and aim the big gun. That big piston, there, regulates the entire system. If we lower it into the main boiler, down there, the pressure will build. If we jam it in there so it can't be raised, the pressure will build until the whole works bursts. Those actuator switches, there, on the catwalks. If we trip them, then break the mechanisms, we'll jam the piston down. Let's go! Did you follow any of that? What's a piston? Oh, knock it off already. If we flip the switches, the gun will blow up. Get it? Now go, you big oaf. Halt! Surrender immediately. We've got to get to the switch. Let's fight our way through. Let's flip the switch. Are you sure it'll work? It'll work. Just keep moving. Pacify the saboteurs. When we throw the switches and the station explodes, we will no longer be inside it, yes? I hope not. More clockworks! Why am I not surprised? Get them! Not the third switch? Throw it, I say! Here goes! One switch left! Move it! Analyzed your attack, and I must say, 
I'm impressed. You and your crew are far more technically capable than you look. I cannot allow you to succeed. This station will prevail. My genius shall endure. Guards, destroy them! is lost! Evacuate! Farewell, mechanical man. We will meet again. Come on! One switch left! Now, just a minute! If we throw this switch, will we have time to get out before the place explodes? Probably. Probably? You're going to have to trust me. Besides, the mission is all that matters. Marleybone is doomed unless we throw that switch, so throw it! It's working! Now let's get out of here, to the elevator! A great horn, Captain, my Captain. Now these walls gonna tumble down. Eh, uh, what do you mean, horn? Are you trying to be funny? Hurry! Let's get out of here before she blows! Report to the dry docks and find Engineer Conrad. She's an expert on clockwork engineering. She'll accompany you and assist with the sabotage. Well done, Captain. The clockworks are reeling now. You've lit the beacon that will light our way to victory. Survived your first suicide mission, eh? I assure you, that is nothing finer. Oh, I remember my first suicide mission. We were off and I... Begging your pardons, sirs. We've intercepted some enemy intelligence that you need to hear. Quick, Captain. Tell him everything that big... Beaked clockwork told Kane. Incredible! This intelligence you found is staggering. If this bishop fiend is right, we're on the very edge of defeat. The Isle of Fetch is already in trouble. The endgame may have begun. So, Rook means to flank us for your Mushu, eh? He's clever, I'll give him that. Gentlemen, I'll take the victory and deal with Rook's little maneuver personally, if you'll excuse me. We'll go help. Oh, no, you don't. You've proven yourself quite handy. I've better use for you. As Nelson hinted, we've lost contact with the Isle of Fetch. Our finest troops are holding the line on Fetch. Kyrgyz, colonial auxiliaries out of Raja. The finest troops in the Empire. Last we'd heard from them, they were complaining about their rations. We upgraded their provisions and haven't had a word from the devils since. If the Kyrgyz falter, the Armada will win a foothold on Fetch. If that happens, all Marleybone is doomed. We need to find out exactly what's going on. Go there and get this sorted out. Pirate, Her Majesty's forces are depending upon you.